Have you driven a Ford lately? Ford and your local Ford dealer who invite you to see the 1983 Ford Cars and Trucks present USFL, the big play. The Los Angeles Coliseum, fourth and inches late in the game. The Express gamble, they don't get it. New Jersey takes over, they're still in the football game. The final play of the game offensively for New Jersey. Was it offensive interference? You bet. No call was made. Larry Brodsky hung on to the pass. Looked like he had the first down, but the officials didn't spot it there. They lost the game 20 to 15. The first Monday night game in USFL history. Novo Bijovic wearing number three for Michigan. Nobody thought he would be a hero early when he booted a 49-yard field goal. You sort of got suspicious a little later when he kicked another one from 49. And you were pretty sure of it near the end of the first half when he kicked his third field goal, all from 49 yards, and he won the game for Michigan over Birmingham, 9-7. to At Mile High Stadium, they packed the stadium. Denver fans all over the place. Denver and Philadelphia doing battle on the opening day of USFL action. Late in the game, Denver third in goal, trailing 13-7. They don't make it. And now fourth in goal, Ken Johnson's pass for Larry. Canada is too far. Philadelphia holds on to win it 13-7 over the Denver Gold opening day in the Mile High State. In the nation's capital, George Allen, a triumphant return for him. The blitz with Greg Landry at the helm. This is Trumaine Johnson. He eludes six tacklers en route to a 33-yard game, but he didn't get in. He fumbled the football inside the five, but as luck would have it for Chicago, Wayman Boggs was the man who fell on it for the touchdown. A little bit later, this time Trumaine Johnson hangs on. Watch the catch. Double coverage. He'll draw that often this year. He juggles it. Presence of mind, and he holds on for a 23 our touchdown, Chicago 28, Washington 7. A seesaw battle all the way in Tampa Bay. John Reeves was the star to Ricky Williams. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. It went back and forth all day with Boston taking the lead, but Reeves gave it back to Tampa Bay again, this time to Eric Trevilian. Another Tampa touchdown. Then with 10 minutes left in the game, it was up to Reeves to win the game for Tampa Bay, and he did so. 33 yards to Willie Gillespie. Nice catch as he turns around. 21-17, Tampa Bay wins over the Boston Breakers. Out in Arizona, it was not a good day for Arizona fans. The first professional football game in the state. And on this tremendous fake, Fred Bissana then hits Wyatt Henderson 53 yards for an Oakland touchdown. A little later, same combination clicks again for 19 yards and another Oakland touchdown as the Invaders go on to shut out the Wranglers 24 to nothing. weekend, the moment everyone in the United States Football League was waiting for. George Allen returned to the nation's capital and returned to the football field. Not just any football field, but RFK Stadium. Don't believe that banner. He's 42-10-1 there. It was an emotional uh, experience for me because I, I wasn't just a Redskin coach. I had my heart and soul in the organization and the city. And I became uh, emotional a couple of times a day on the sidelines playing the national anthem and and uh, but I'm very proud of my team and uh, the staff and the organization. We played like pros. We didn't make uh, many mistakes, and we beat a good football team. This league is for real. Uh, the Chicago Blitz is for real. And the league is going to go and be successful and expand, and there'll be expansion after that. Uh, anyone that doesn't uh, think that has uh, ulterior motive. Uh, America. This league is good for America, and uh, football is is uh, is a sport that is made for television. I may have changed because I uh, I'm not uh, in this new league. I can't let uh, little things bother me. I used to uh, have this the expression that no detail is too small, and uh, I still believe that. But uh, the other day we went to practice with 50 players and coaches and everything we didn't have any footballs you see so that would have bothered me but i thought well that's that's every day there's some little thing like that that happens and uh, and i know until we get better organized we just roll with the punches